One who can't determine his goals cannot win. A man is born alone and dies alone, and he experiences the good and bad consequences of his karma alone, and he goes alone to hell or the supreme abode. Do not reveal what you have thought upon doing, but by wise counsel, keep it secret, being determined to carry it into execution. Never make friends with people who are above or below you in status. Such friendships will never give you any happiness. He who is overly attached to his family members experiences fear and sorrow, for the root of all grief is attachment. Thus one should discard attachment to be happy. The world's biggest power is the beauty and the youth of a woman. There is some self-interest behind every friendship. There is no friendship without self-interest. This is a bitter truth. It is better to die than to preserve this life by incurring disgrace. He who lives in our mind is near. He who lives in our mind is near, though he may actually be far away. But he who is not in our heart is far, though he may really be nearby. The loss of life causes but a moment's grief, but disgrace brings grief every day of one's life. Treat your kid like a darling for the first five years. For the next five years, scold them. By the time they turn 16, treat them like a friend. Your grown-up children are your best friends. No one can defeat a powerful mind. Even if a snake is not poisonous, it should pretend to be venomous. Wealth, a friend, a wife, and a kingdom may be regained, but the body, when lost, may never be acquired again. As a single withered tree is set aflame, causes a whole forest to burn, so does a rascal son destroy a whole family. The life of an uneducated man is as useless as the tail of a dog, which neither covers its rear end nor protects it from bites of insects. A wise man should restrain his senses like the crane and accomplish his purpose with due knowledge of his place, time, and ability. The serpent, the king, the tiger, the stinging wasp, the small child, the dog owned by other people, and the fool. These seven ought not be awakened from sleep. The one excellent thing that can be learned from a lion is that whatever a man intends doing should be done by him with a wholehearted and strenuous effort. Purity of speech, of the mind, of the senses, and of the compassionate heart are needed by one who desires to rise to the divine platform. Drop the idea that love and attachment are the one thing. They are enemies. It is attachment that destroys all love. One whose knowledge is confined to books and whose wealth is a possession of others can use neither knowledge nor wealth to carry it into execution. We should not fret for what is the past, nor should we be anxious about the future. Men of discernment deal only with the present moment. Never reveal what you have thought upon doing, but by wise counsel, 
keep its secret being determined to carry it into execution. The earth is supported by truth. It is the power of truth that makes the sun shine and the winds blow. Indeed, all things rest upon truth. God is not present in idols. Your feelings are your God. The soul is your temple. Every neighboring state is an enemy, and the enemy's enemy is a friend. Before you do some work, always ask yourself three questions. Why am I doing it? What the results might be? And will I be successful? Only when you think deeply and find satisfactory answers to these questions, go ahead. Just as it is impossible to know when a swimming fish is drinking water, it is impossible to find out when a government servant is stealing money. Whoever imposes severe punishment becomes repulsive to the people, while he who awards mild punishment becomes contemptible. But whoever imposes his punishment as deserved becomes respectable. For every effect, there is a specific cause. Success is not an accident. Success is not based on chance. Success is not a matter of luck. Success is the result of a well thought out action. Success needs action. Action needs initiative. He shall despise none, but hear the opinions of all. A wise man shall make use of even a child's sensible utterance. If a king is energetic, his subjects will be equally energetic. If he is reckless, they will not only be reckless likewise, but also eat into his works. As soon as the fear approaches near, attack and destroy it. Education is the best friend. An educated person is respected everywhere. Education beats the beauty and the youth. Books are useful to a stupid person, as a mirror is useful to a blind person. Knowledge is lost without putting it into practice. A man is lost to ignorance. An army is lost without a commander. And a woman is lost without a husband. O oh, wise man, give your wealth only to the worthy and never to others. The water of the sea received by the clouds is always sweet. Avoid him who talks sweetly before you, but tries to ruin you behind your back, for he is like a pitcher full of poison with milk on top. God does not dwell in the wooden, stony, or earthen idols. His abode is in our feelings, our thoughts, a man is great by deeds, not by birth. Test a servant while in the discharge of his duty, a relative in difficulty, a friend in adversity, and a wife in misfortune. The biggest guru mantra is, never share your secrets with anybody. It will destroy you. Once you start working on something, don't be afraid of failure, and don't abandon it. People who work sincerely are the happiest. Humbleness is at the root of self-control. Learn from other people's mistakes. You can't live long enough to make them all yourselves. A person should not be too honest. Straight trees are cut first, and honest people are screwed first. 
There is no austerity equal to balanced mind, and there is no happiness equal to contentment. There is no disease like covetousness, and no virtue like mercy. If one has a good disposition, what other virtue is needed? If a man has fame, what is the value of other ornamentation? The happiness and peace attained by those satisfied by the nectar of spiritual tranquility is not attained by greedy persons restlessly moving here and there. As long as your body is healthy and under control and death is distant, try to save your soul. When death is imminent, what can you do? Time perfects men as well as destroys them. All creatures are pleased by loving words, and therefore we should address words that are pleasing to all, for there is no lack of sweet words. Sinfully acquired wealth may remain for ten years. In the eleventh year, it disappears when even the original stock. A man attains greatness by his merits, not simply by occupying an exalted seat. Can we call a crow an eagle simply because he sits on top of a building? He who is prepared for the future, and he who deals cleverly with any situation that may arise, are both happy. But the fatalistic man who wholly depends on luck is ruined. We should always speak what would please the man of whom we expect a favor? Like the hunter who sings sweetly when he desires to shoot a deer. We should not feel pride in our charity, austerity, valor, scriptural knowledge, modesty, and morality, for the world is full of the rarest gems. There are three gems upon this earth, food, water, and pleasing words. Fools consider pieces of rocks as gems. Who realizes all the happiness that he desires? Everything is in the hands of God. Therefore, one should learn contentment. A task in which an expedient is used is not difficult to achieve. He who forsakes his own community and joins another, perishes as the king who embraces an unrighteous path. The weak should seek refuge in the strong. Power is the cause of alliances. If people are prosperous, even a leaderless state can be governed. Righteousness is the root of happiness. Prosperity abandons one who is satisfied with wealth. By failing to plan, you are planning to fail. Every effective performance is based on thorough preparation. Accumulated wealth is saved by spending just as incoming fresh water is saved by letting out stagnant water. There is poison in the fang of a serpent, in the mouth of a fly, and in the sting of a scorpion, but the wicked man is saturated with it. The fragrance of flowers spreads only in the direction of the wind, but the goodness of a person spreads in all directions. <laughs>